to give a quick shout out to our sponsor, Instant Gaming. So if you didn't know by now, The Sims 4 base game is free to download on all platforms. But since the base game is free, you know what that means? more money to spend on expansion packs so that way you can get the most out of your game head on over to instant gaming today and get all your expansion packs and your favorite pc games at a discounted price the link is in the description hello lolers welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video we're back with our let's play living single i don't remember what episode we're on my bad okay but if you haven't seen the previous episodes make sure you check out the description there's a link to the last episode as well as a link to the playlist so that way you can start from the beginning and get all caught up and tiffany your titties are busting out your top friend but yeah today uh, Bitch, no, you did not just sneeze over the food. Okay, she tried to look around to see if anybody else saw it. Girl, all the LOLers saw. Anyway, would it really be a LOL Kalia Sims 4 Let's Play? <laughs> Tiffany, bitch, get it together. <laughs> anyway, I was Okay. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all, bro, because she, she's so funny. But I was trying to say, would it be a Sims 4 um, let's play if we didn't start the episode in the morning with my Sims cooking breakfast. No, it wouldn't. But we just made some Cajun salmon and cheesy bacon grits. It's 740 in the morning and pay and ooh, Paisley. Mm. Uh, Tiffany just came back from the strip club like two hours ago. But the thing is, hold on. Let me do an another typical LOL Kalia move and have my Sims use the bathroom and brush their teeth in the morning as well. She just came home from the strip club like a couple hours ago. But while she was in the club, y'all, she was crying in the club. <laughs> and I really mean she was crying in the club because she was sad. She don't want to be a hoe forever. Like, being a hoe right now in your 20s is cool, but, like, she was thinking about, like, when she get older. She needs to get it together. She wants her Prince Charming, her rich man, to save her from her troubles. You know, dumb bitches being dumb bitches. She thinks it's McMoss, but, like, be for real. McMoss is for everybody. Anyway, um, I say all that to say that the reason she's, she's up and early cooking breakfast, even though she just got home from work. Oh, look. Hey, Mick, I thought I could celebrate with you today for a little while. Do you mind? Me <laughs> Today's Valentine's Day. He got bitches calling him at 8 in the morning. Tell Bosom, yeah, I thought I could celebrate today with you. And I was just about to say that Tiffany being the dumb bitch she is, she thinks Mick Moss is her Prince Charming, but... Girl, how your Prince Charming got other bitches calling him at 8 in the morning? Like, hello? She made this breakfast for him... That's why she was showing off in the kitchen making Cajun salmon and cheesy bacon grits. Listen, Tiffany don't even eat breakfast like that, okay? But for Mick Moss, listen, she's trying to get a come up, okay? Like, she's tired of stripping. She's tired of paying her own bills. Like, school is expensive. She still has to go back to school because for real, for what she's trying to be is a nurse. But she only has four credits because, bitch, she's on her own. Who else gonna pay for her tuition, okay? But... We made McMoss some breakfast. Oh, do we have some weed? We could roll him like a little blunt too. I think we have weed, I think. We have weed, but I don't think we have roll-ups. Does um Tiffany's best friend have roll-ups? She should. Damn, we don't have roll-ups. Okay, I went in build buy mode and I bought me some roll-ups. So we're gonna roll a little morning <laughs> J for McMoss too. Tiffany on her pick me shit, okay? She trying to get chose. How can she lose when she's already chose? Like, like, hello? I mean, technically she is chose. Well, okay, she thinks she chose. But for real, for real, Mick Moss, he just, he just stacking his money and he trying to live rent free so he can live somewhere nice and lavish and he is not taking Tiffany with him, okay? So, mm. <laughs> But look, we love when bitches dream. Everybody needs to have dreams. It's the foundation of life, you know? What is life without dreams? Let's try to wake Mick Moss up. Yeah, let's wake him up. Let's wake him up. <laughs> I wonder if he's going to be mad he got woken up. I don't think so. I don't think The Sims that advanced yet, but. Okay, so we getting a little morning loving on. Oh, well, a lot of morning loving on. 
Whoa. <laughs> Tiffany must be desperate for, for some coins because she is tonguing Mick Moss down and he just woke up. Like, that hot ass breath. I don't know if money is worth it. I don't, I don't know if anyone can pay me enough. Uh, to kiss them with this hot ass breath. Loan it. Actually, I'm lying because if you offer me a million dollars, I will definitely breathe through my mouth. Wait, it's Mick picking a fight with my sis. And they was just cool. Hold up, y'all. Hold up. Hold up. He just not acting right. You feel me? He just needs some get right. But I want to do. Okay, I want to try these. What is a long kiss? We're going to see. Galoof. Maybe he needs a long kiss. Like, don't yell at me, bae. Just kiss me. Charky. Oh, he doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> he doesn't want to kiss. Why? What did I do to you? Oh, my gosh. Discuss the meal. He's talking shit about oh. Tiffany's food, and he didn't even eat it yet. That's so rude. Luna. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, now y'all cool. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, you know what? It's nice to know that Mick Moss is like this with everybody, you know? Like, at least Paisley isn't the problem. It's him. He's just not right. Apologize in bed? All right, we're going to do it. Let's try. Let's see. Is Kaya talking uh -huh. to? Who is this person? She's talking to she's talking to the paparazzi that came here from McMoss. Hold on, let me say hi to our neighbor. Let's say good morning. Hey Malachi. I forgot that Malachi existed. Like, we need to get my boy married or something. What's up with that? I totally forgot about Malachi. Ever since um Nazir and Marquise moved out. Oh, he wanted to hang out. That's so cute. Wait! What? Oh my gosh! Wait, congratulate on engagement and thoughts about upcoming wedding. Oh my gosh, Malachi is engaged to who? Who are you engaged to? What? Um. Sharp. Can we see? Who is he engaged to? Oh my gosh, we can't see in the thing. Wow. I wish we could ask. Wow. Malachi, who are you engaged to? No, I got to check out Malachi see what he's doing. Because, like, what? Why are you engaged? Meanwhile, That's Tiffany crazy. working on her meal ticket over here. Oh, walks up. Look at her. <laughs> Acting like Jocelyn in that studio. <laughs> Just for Mick Moss to say she be talking too much. But I think Mick Moss, he horny, y'all. Oh my gosh, my ish small. This is from when Tiffany apologized in bed. Shorty says she didn't feel nothing. Damn, yo, my ish type small. I can't have these hoes out here talking bad about my pipe game in these streets. I might have to lick that thing and spit some bars on it or something. What? <laughs> Wait. He gonna try to redeem himself. So, yeah, let's let's see what we got. Let's see what we got going on in here. Fuizak <laughs> Verobe? Yumba Sturm. Seven A. Mhm. Ha! Oh my God! I think we should take a pregnancy test. Lafi, Bjork, Kachul. He's still talking about this damn food, and he has yet to try it. Like, stop being, <laughs> stop acting like that, literally, bruh. But um, yeah, we gonna have them share this together. Uh -huh. Tiffany really on her pick me share. Like, she woke this man up to pussy. Rolled a J for him and cooked him breakfast. And just just for him to talk shit about the breakfast that he hasn't even tried yet. Like, whoa. Talk about going out sad, huh? But after we finish this, we're going to see if Tiffany pregnant. I doubt it, though. Mick Moss, if you had Tiffany pregnant, that'd be crazy. But Milan does need a sibling, though. <laughs> so, Yeah. By the way, make sure you guys follow me on Twitch. We've been back on Twitch lately, okay? But, oh, no, Tiffany's sleepy. Okay. Well, she was shaking her ass all night, and then she woke up. Oh, my. This is who you're with, Tiffany. This is who you're playing housewife for. A man who be farting in your bed. Oh, my God. That's so sad. Let's eat these grits. And Mick Moss, he's actually going to go to the stew today. Because his child support payment is due tomorrow. 
<laughs> she finally put Mick Moss on child support. Are you at home? Are you busy? Mariah, why the fuck are you asking Mick Moss if he's home and if he's busy, bitch? I'm watching you. It better be to talk about Paisley. But anyway, I was saying, what the fuck was I saying? Before Mariah, little big head, itself interrupts with me. Oh, yeah, I was saying that Paisley finally put Mick Moss on child support. So, but he's trying to buy a house because honestly, he's so tired of staying with Tiffany. Like, Grenoble. um, when did you get here? Hello, when <laughs> did you dang. get here? <laughs> When did Jordan get here? Y'all remember Mariah X Jordan? When did he get here? My <laughs> homie stayed ten toes down. If they ever need me to, to come right out for the gang, all they gotta do is hit my line. Oh boy, if y'all don't just suck his dick, why don't you, huh? Just go ahead. We won't judge you. It's a safe space. But yeah, anyway, I was saying that McMoss is finally on child support, so he has to make some money. However, He's trying to buy a house because he's tired of staying with, um, what's her face? Tiffany? Yeah, he's tired of staying with her. Like, she deadass be trying to be his girl, and it ain't even that. Like, he just needed somewhere to stay because Paisley kicked him out. If Mick Moss had it his way, he would be staying with his baby mama right now, okay? That's who he really miss. He really misses baby mama. Like, her coochie is just so warm, and, you know, it's just it just reminds him of home. But his baby mama kicked him out, so he here with the next best option, which is Tiffany. And Tiffany thinks she got one up on Paisley just because Mick Moss is staying with her. But, bitch, he is hobosexual, okay? I mean, he has money, so he's not really hobosexual. But, you know, he technically is just because he being a little cheapo. And he not trying to pay rent nowhere else. So, Tiffany offered him free rent, free pussy, free breakfast, and a J. Listen, who the fuck is Mick Moss to deny that? Okay, y'all, so we're about to go to the stew with Mick Moss. Like I said, child support is due tomorrow. Okay, so tonight he's going to try to make a hit. Hopefully, he really makes a hit and gets a bag from it. Mick Moss, he's not poor, but he's trying to buy a house. And the fact that he needs to pay, like, almost 17,000 simoleons in child support is just absurd to him, okay? So, yeah. We will see you guys at the stew, BRB. Hey, y'all. So, we in the stew. McMoss with his friend Jordan. They just hit a J. Y'all know. We need that hashtag inspo before we lay it down in the booth. But, um, damn, we had more microphones than this. I don't know where the rest of them went. But I forgot who this recording studio is by. But I renovated it because, I don't know, it just was so small, but it's still under construction right now, right? So I wanted there to be like a little bedroom, a bar, of course, because Mick Moss loved drinking. And I also put this dance studio up here too. So when Mick Moss gets ready for his concerts, you know, the girls can practice their choreography here at the studio but yeah it's under construction right now y'all so if the uh, lot looks a mess right now don't judge me but yeah like i said we hit a j getting hashtag inspired so we can start making some music and actually mick moss is about to invite the hoes to the studio because what is a studio session without the hoes like come on y'all be for real he also wants to drink some lean but he don't know who be having the lean out here and Jordan, can you not do um, push-ups in the stew? He always goes to Marquise for some Coke, but he don't know who be having lean. Here. Landon always got all the good shit, so. Let's go. Schemes Maybe Landon cola. got some codeine, yeah. too. So we can finally drink some lean. Some of our favorite rappers have done their best songs while they was off that drink. Okay, so Mick Moss, he's inspired. He's trying to, you know, have that same essence. All right, y'all, Landon pulled up. We asked him about drug quality. We're going to try to buy some drugs from him. Hopefully he has some lean. Like, how can I be a real rapper without lean? What kind of sense does that even make? Oh, buy yeah, prescription drugs. Let's see what he got. Oh, look, he got it. But damn, he taxing on this shit. Real up adding 44 extra simoleons. I ain't never been broke, period. <laughs> or potato. So, yeah. Jasper. Thank you, Landon. 
Maybe. I'm gonna send them home. Where the hoes at? I invited them over. Like, I need some. Oh, here they go. Here's one of the Cocos. Look how everyone looking at her just because her ass fat. Like, y'all be hating. Little towny looking self. But yeah, this is Pink London. And uh, we got another one that's supposed to be pulling up too. Yup, here we go. My girl, Rhea Rose. The cocaine companions. Let me put the girls in a, a group. Oh, we can't add Miss Thang into a group because we don't know her, Pink London. But let's add Rhea Rose. <laughs> I'm so annoying, Rhea Rose, Pink London. Like, <laughs> what can I say? I just, I'm inspired by everything. I'm a sponge, you know? But I hope Pink London come upstairs. Okay, she's not. I really want her to. Should we go downstairs? Let's go downstairs and meet her. Let's be a gentleman. I mean, Mika Moss is just trying to f for real, for real, but let's. Besties, romantic in introduction. What does that even mean? Nah, I'm gonna do a flirty introduction. Like, he don't even do all that bestie shit. Like, he, he be trying to fuck, and he's not ashamed of it. He's proud of it, for real, for real. Like, <laughs> so let's see. Let's see what he got going on. Yeah, Rhea, just sit down, get comfy, girl. We about to pour up the lean in a little bit, don't worry. And why is the bartender on the opposite side of the bar? Like, okay. <laughs> Malady. <laughs> oh, look at them, hitting it off. <laughs> dag, dag. Hitting it off already, look. Super attractive, extremely attractive. First impressions, interesting sim, and her first impression of him is that he's adventurous. This sim seems to have lived so much in a city one day and another the next, from job to job and from love affair to yet another. It makes him a little fascinating. Oh, you like that fast-paced lifestyle, huh? Okay! Look, already. Already talk about the woohoo. Like, damn. Can you offer my sister some water first? Like, she thirsty. Like, what a, what a whore. McMoss is such a whore. <laughs> we just ordered some shots, y'all. You know, he gotta be a gentleman. Gotta make sure the girl's straight, especially because he was talking to Pink Lenton about woohoo. He didn't even offer my, my sis something to drink first. Like, yeah, so we're gonna offer her some tequila. Everyone gonna take their little tequila shots. And then I guess we gonna pull up. Sip on that drink, and hopefully we'll record. Mick Moss been doing everything but recording. <laughs> he been smoking, getting hay, everything but recording, like boo. The child support payment is due tomorrow. I mean, he has money though. Don't ever get it twisted. And look, she got a crush on him already. Oh look, deeply in love, not even a crush. She deeply in love with him already. I mean, look, when you got money. Look, both of them just said I would do anything for a line of coke right now. All right, y'all, hold up, relax, relax. Rhea, drink your shot since you do anything for a line of coke. Accept her advances, whoa! Oh! Everybody want a piece of McMoss tonight. Hold up, can I pull up? I wanna see. I wanna put it down, I wanna see if I can. <laughs> but there's like no table, so it's kinda hard. Oh, poor cup of lean, I wonder if I could do it on the floor. There's dead ass, like, I don't know why they won't let me put it on this table, but yeah. I don't know, let's see if I can pour it on the floor. <laughs> Come on, let the lady sit. Oh, <laughs> he can't. He can pour it on the floor. All right, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's sip some. McMoss got some bad habits. He has some terrible vices. Oh my God, McMoss. Oh, he doesn't have any Coke. Hold on, let me invite Marquise up. Let me invite Marquise here. 
Damn, he doesn't. He invited these cocos and he don't even have no no product. Like, look, they over here feeding. I am jonesing for a line of coke. Like, come on, feed your girls. Feed the girls. They starving over here. Hopefully, Marquise has some coke. Oh my gosh, we can buy ketamine. Girl, since when? <laughs> Whoa. But we're about to buy some shit from Marquise. Not they gotta sit down for this business transaction. Oh my gosh, we don't have no money. Hold up, hold up, hold up, y'all, hold up. Let me transfer some money from his bank account. And y'all see 326,366 simoleons. Like, who's broke? Who broke? Oh, he thought so. Um, We're just gonna take 2,000 out for now. We don't want too much because he don't like putting his money in the household funds because then Tiffany thinks that they have money. But no, he has money. Not they. He has money. Tiffany better get her own money. He already got to give his baby mama 16,000 simoleons. He ain't giving no bitch no more simoleons. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> but look, we're going to get average quality. Because, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. He don't care about these hoes. He ain't spoiling them with, with that good shit. Oh, we already had cocaine. <laughs> but it's okay. They can't get in his good stash. Oh, and Mick Moss, he got songs he ain't released yet. Oh, we need to release some shit tonight. Why is there so many people in the studio? And Mick Moss is stressed because someone is out here. Oh my gosh, look at him. That boy got crabs. <laughs> Bruh, damn, all he did was f Tiffany and now he got crabs, like, whoa. But yeah, he's stressed because someone is playing guitar terribly. I guess it's Cameron Arnold, like, put that shit down. I put this little table down. Let's try to um give them girls that fix they've been feeding for. You know, give them what they came for type shit. Okay. Look at them girls. Oh, it's a finale. class. They talk about how much they love pussy. Y'all seen that? Y'all seen that thought bubble? Let's try to lay a track down in the stew, shall we? We gonna write some lyrics. We gonna do a mournful lament. That drink got my boy kind of in his feelings. You know, he misses his baby mama, so he gonna sing about it. Even though he could have kept her, but he was just being a little dickhead, you know? So, whatever. But yeah, we recording, y'all. And look, she watching. Why is he holding the microphone like this? <laughs> is he okay? Mick Moss, are you okay? Now he got the groupies in the booth with him. This little random groupie. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, Jordan, don't be hugging my hoes. These my hoes. Get your own hoes. Yeah, look at Rhea Rose. She cheering me on, y'all. No, but he over here really trying to steal my hoes. That boy Mick Moss singing. Y'all hear them vocals? Garby her oh. some gray. He sounded like a backstreet boy. <laughs> Give him boy band. Okay. Mick Moss, he's multi talented. He has his own hits up under his belt, of course, but where he really shines, he's really good at producing and writing songs for other people. A freak. Mick just finished writing a song. What would you like to name it? Um, we're going to name it P for Pretty. Because, you know, P for Paisley, but P for Pretty. <laughs> yeah, we ate that up. Y'all, we in the stew dropping the tracks late at night. Like, yeah. Who's doing it like us? Okay. We're going to release some tracks because... Apparently, he has some unreleased tracks just sitting in his inventory. So, we got Hustlin' and we got Stay Feenin'. I'm gonna do Stay Feenin'. 
Just cause I love that song, Stay Scheming. <laughs> That's where I got the inspo from. But oh my gosh, Mick Moss has crab lice. Mick Moss acquired crab lice, parasitic insects that infest human genital areas and cause intense itching. Wow, not him being nasty. Release my song. <laughs> what? Oh, never mind. It worked now. <laughs> Yay, Stay Feed and Release Mix Music has been uploaded to the Sim 5 service for everyone to hear. And I cannot wait until we get these checks, okay? Um, but we got these new Moodlet studio sessions. Being at the studio brings out all types of musicians. Just don't party too much here with all the temptation around. Just being here and being able to create in the space will inspire you to the fullest. And we got this other Moodlet dropped a new song, Bars is Back. Snapback, V-neck, trues, plus a mic in it. None of these rappers got a flow like me. My new song is so fire. It's for show sure gonna light up the music charts and make some noise at the record labels. I'm ready to perform this on stage in front of fans. Okay. Oh, who? Pink London argue with? She arguing with Jordan? He's scaring the hoes away. Anyway, Mick Moss, he did enough work today. It's time for him to play, okay? I would do anything for a line of coke right now. All right, let's see. Let's see if y'all go do anything. We better be in the stew with it. Pink London hitting a J. All right, let's talk to Rhea Rose while Pink London finished what she was doing. Okay, let's compliment Rhea Rose's appearance. Why he not sitting with her? Why he just sat all the way over there? I hate when they do that shit, bro. Mick Moss over here making moves. Okay. We put some coke on the table for Rhea Rose since she was fiending. She stay fiending. Can I please have a line of coke now? Oh, she fiending too. Oh, and they're having their first kiss. Oh, Mick Moss kissing bitches in the stew. And y'all, that boy Mick Moss is dangerously horny. Real life, intense lust. So much lust makes you uncomfortable. It would be wise to find a way to release this tension. Well, let's see. Now it's 2.30 in the morning and make a moss acting up. And can Jordan do anything but hit a J? Like, damn. Oh, wow, Mick. This is how Mick Moss gets down, y'all. He got crabs still while all this happening. Like a lollipop from kissing soft lips. She said she want to lick the rapper, so I let her lick the rapper like a lollipop. Shorty got some smooth, soft lips. How about the fact that you have crabs, bitch, huh? What about that? Anyway, y'all, we're about to go home and make sure y'all pledge to the uncut version so you can watch exclusive scenes and catch all of the tea. Anyway, we're about to go home. I hope Big Moss makes some more money, like, ASAP, so we can get him an apartment because he wants to, to bring Pink Lenzen and Rhea Rose home with him to have some more fun, okay? Wink, wink. They had some fun at the stew, but it's like, this not his house, you feel me? Like, he's already skating on thin ice. He's a non-committal sim, why would he care? And he's rich, he can do whatever he wants. It's the way the party followed Mick Moss home. Okay, Mick Moss, he is really gonna go to sleep though. He needs to get some rest. He's been in the stew all night, been working all day. But I'm gonna have um Kaya go to sleep too. Everyone better go to sleep. It's Monday. It's like 6 in the morning. Everyone's going to sleep. Everyone's going to catch up on some sleep. Tonight, we're going to go to the strip club with Tiffany because we always go to the strip club with Paisley, but never with Tiffany. So if you want to watch that, like I said, make sure you pledge to the Patreon, all right? We also have some Patreon exclusive videos on there for the girls as well. Today is my favorite holiday. I want to come spread some holiday cheer. Your favorite holiday is rebate day? Like, Marquise, be serious for one second. Seriously. Oh, you had a good night's sleep. Okay, purr. So Tiffany just woke up. She's about to be the pick me that we already know she is. And she's about to do Mick Moss laundry for him. Even though he was fucking other bitches and he got crabs. But... You know, all bitches see is dollar signs. So, what can we do? If she want to be dumb, that's her. That's her problem. So we're gonna wash this. Tiffany, let's see school. Let's see what like what the tea with school is, right? 
Because Tiffany wants to go back to school. She wants to be a nurse. She's kind of tired of stripping. It's just not in her destiny. Oh, my God. Did this shit just break? Whoa, it did. It did just break. Oh, my God. Nar. Okay, Tiffany got some handiness skills. So, let's see. Let's see if she really got handiness skill. Let's see if she can fix it. You know, hashtag woman in STEM. Really, McMaw should be fixing it, but yeah. McMaw's got some money for his music. Damn, he is not raking in the big bucks. Oh, he needs to get signed. He needs to get signed. That's what it is. He's not making that much money from his music because he's not signed anymore. He lost his record deal. Okay, well, we need to get signed again. So we can bring in them bucks, because what the heck? Only 3,000 simoleons? I thought he was going to bring in at least, like, 10K. That's what he used to bring in. This sim is not getting the sleep that they hoped they would. Oh, I thought this was about him having crabs. Maybe he's not getting the sleep he's supposed to because he's getting itching and burning. Like, maybe that's the thing. But good morning, Big Moss. Nice of you to join the rest of us. And Kaya is awake, too. Kaya, she just likes to smoke and draw. She's an artist. She does tattoos for people here and there. She loves tattoos. That's why she has so many tattoos. She was going to school for art, but she just didn't understand why she had to pay for someone to teach her how to draw when she already knew how to draw. But it says she's not quite stoned, so we're going to have her smoke again. Damn, it's dirty in here. Why? Oh, because of this. Is it clean? Alright, we're going to add this laundry to the dryer. McMoss, he needs to hold his weight in this house because, yeah. Oh, this is the plumber. You're too late. We already fixed it. Like, men are so useless. Let's get the mail, though. Snur, huh? <laughs> Not Malachi beefing with the plumber. Like, <laughs> the Sims will beef with anybody. Lady. Like, anybody can get it. And I respect it. I really do. Like, period. Anybody can get it. Oh, a J was in the mail. I guess because Mick Moss gets drugs in the mail. But, like, where's the cocaine? Like, y'all just gave me weed. Oh, he mad over basketball. <laughs> I'm dead. But damn, I didn't know we had weed already in the house. Okay. Oh. Oh, she. Now she rubbing on McMoss' ass. Okay. <laughs> okay, friend. Passionate romance. Butterflies in the sky. Tiffany Gonzalez feels just as high after that sizzling moment spent with McMoss. Tiffany has a full heart and her head in the clouds. She will be daydreaming about Mick's electrifying touch for a while. <laughs> Tiffany can take pleasure of up to two passionate moments a few times a day. Every passionate moment boosts Tiffany's well-being and helps her stay happy with special lucky effects. Oh, what mod is this? Hold up. Hold up. Felt the spark. There no I please. Oh. Oh, they bought a woohoo. Oh. But yeah, we're going to let them have their moment. But it says the touch that Tiffany shared with her lover felt like a strike of lightning. A touch like that could jumpstart a heart. It sent shivers down their spine. And Tiffany still feels her skin tingling with excitement when thinking about it. Ooh. Oh, my God. Wait, try for baby. No protection was used. Thank you. <laughs> Mick. Yeah, that's you smelling like that, sweetie. It is. It is. That woohoo wasn't satisfactory. Improvement needed. Girl, why are you not using protection? Especially with Mick Moss. Like, if you itching and burning, don't start complaining, bitch. Oh, she said that woohoo wasn't satisfactory either. <gasps> Maybe Mick Moss' dick is small. Remember he was complaining about how Tiffany said his dick was small earlier? Like, maybe his dick is small. Like, that would explain why Tiffany isn't feeling... Hashtag satisfied, you know? She worn out. She better go to sleep. I want her to be well rested because I want her to go to the strip club tonight and work. So, yeah, but wow, McMoss. Wow. We need to get this boy signed. That's what we need to do. What's wrong with you? 
Oh, she's having a cannabis-induced oh, headache. Yeah. Oh, you're too high. Well, whose fault is that? You told us something you wasn't high enough. Not quite stoned. Hold up. Oh, she doesn't have any more weed. Who sells weed? Does she know Marquise? No, she doesn't know Marquise. Hold up. Maybe I should call Marquise over so he could give her some weed. Oh, Marquise is already in the neighborhood. Oh, I love that for us. Yeah, let's have her go down and see Marquise. Let's have them meet each other. Hopefully they hit it off. Kaya is about to go downstairs and meet Marquise so she could buy some gas off of him. Tiffany's sleeping. McMoss is taking a bubble bath with his sassy self. <laughs> and yeah. Hopefully Kaya and Marquise get along. And maybe this will be her permanent plug. Maybe they'd be good friends too since they both like art. This is you know? Oh, she don't like him. <laughs> oh, she doesn't like him. She thinks he's dramatic. Oh, we can buy drugs from him. Yes, hallucinogens. Let's buy some weed. All right, it's done. We bought some gas. Wait, let's check Twitter real quick. Not Mick asking her if she's up for a call sometimes. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, wow. That was the Twitter notification. Mick Moss is disgusting. Mick Moss, you're... Yeah. You'll pay for your crimes. And why are you eating ice cream? Because <laughs> why is he enjoying this ice cream cone so much? Like, the boy got a brain freeze. <laughs> As a man, why are you enjoying ice cream so much? Like... You need to be eating a manly snack like beef jerky. No, bae. I'm trying to commit to a sim. A, I see you couldn't stand not being mine. You wanted the perfect mate, and that's me. Now, there are a few things you need to do and maintain in order to keep me interested. Don't slip up. Yeah, I told y'all he's sassy. McMoss is one of the, the proponents of sassy man apocalypse. It's him. He's the problem, y'all. If you're hungry, why are you eating ice cream? You should be eating a lumberjack breakfast. And oh, Tiffany is yucky. knocked, boy. Oh, McMoss was supposed to see Milan today. Oh, well, it didn't work out that way. It didn't. But <laughs> we need to get this boy a whatchamacallit. Um... Oh, we can license lyrics. Yes. P for pretty. So he can let Paisley know that he missed her. He going to put it out in the world. Yeah, we need to get McMoss a little producing station so he could just be cooking shit up in Tiffany apartment. Y'all know every apartment that he shack up in, he got to bring his music set up with him. And Paisley petty as hell for selling his music equipment. That's exactly why he ain't want to send her as child support in the first place. But, you know, government shit. He had no choice. But yay, we just licensed some lyrics. And... Uh, oh, the bills are due, but I don't know who gonna pay them bills, but it ain't McMoss. Uh, Ma Marquise, why did you just walk up in here like that? Well, let's have them smoke together <laughs> since he's here. I know all I do is have my sim smoking, but that's all there is to do in life. Like life is so boring. All you can do is eat, smoke, and fuck and drink sometimes, you know? Oh, we don't have any roll-ups. Oh my God, I hate it here. Wow. Be Niara. Oh, Kaya came to join us. Does she think Marquise is cute? I never checked. Let's see. Yeah, perceived as very attractive. Okay. Ooh. Oh, we should have them roll up together. Do we have... We have some roll-ups right here. We finna steal them. Yeah, we're gonna have them smoke together. Hold on, I sense a new connection happening. Hold on. Let's open. <laughs> Mick Moss, what are you doing? <sighs> oh, he's cleaning the tub. Oh, no, bitch, you did cocaine. No, you did cocaine. And he tried to clean the tub so he could act like he wasn't doing nothing. Like, look at you. Mick has done a wicked, a wicked amount of cocaine. Like, what? What do you mean a wicked amount? Wow, Mick really thinks he's slick. Like, bitch, I'm onto you. And, oh, and now... Now you're drying the laundry without someone having to tell you. Like, oh, yeah, what an upstanding citizen. Yeah. All right, girl, come on. 
Adrian always calling someone for some coke. First, she was calling Marquise. Now she calling McMoss. Like, she don't got no customer loyalty. Oh, look at Marquise and Kaya smoking. I think at like seven, we're going to have everyone. Well, Kaya yeah. and Stay hey, babe, moment. are you busy? I miss you. Oh, my gosh. I miss you. I want to see you. Can you come over right now? Girl, you got a man. This is Marquise's friend, Chaz. Girl, you got a man. Hey, babe, are you busy? I miss you. I want to see you. Can are we going to go? Sir? We going to go. I'm finna go. Wait, is 121 Hakeem house her house? Oh my gosh, is Marquise leaving because his friend is coming over? Oh my gosh, he is. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh wow, uh, this, no, this is the real city girls. These are the real city girls right here. And Mick, who are you on the phone with? Call a friend, yeah, a quote unquote friend. I wonder who the friend in question is. Kaya, you got a man? Why nobody even, oh, I guess this is why we ain't know you had a man. Cause your man be beefing with you, he be picking with you. Oh, okay. Oof. This hurts sometimes, man. Uh, Everything's uh, happening so fast. <laughs> they was just beefing, then they was loving, now they got an attractiveness alert. Like, whoa. Oh, Mick was on the phone with Mariah. This event, hanging out with Lover. Meanwhile, she was just flirting with Marquise, one of his best friends. Like, oh. No, because Kaya really got a man, and she had intense lust. Deeply in love. She deeply in love with this man, Fleur with Marquise. Like, girl, what? Oh, not Kaya and Chaz about to get it in. All right, sister. All right, y'all, we're about to go to the strip club. Tiffany taking a bath. And Kaya saying bye to Chaz. She finally finished getting her little Dooney's bust. So now she ready to work. <laughs> but... Yeah, I'm waiting for Tiffany to hurry up and finish taking her bath. But y'all know Mick Moss got crabs. It's probably going to take her a minute to wash her little coochie. She don't even know how dirty it really is. Like, that's the sad part. But let's check Twitter while we wait. Damn, it's about to be 11 o'clock. Like, this boy Xavier. Tiffany, what's up, buddy? Xavier, you up? Like, not you asking guys if they up. Why you doing Mick Moss raw? But Xavier, that's like her real love. Like she love Xavier, but he don't got as much money as Mick Moss, and she need a man with money. So yeah, but we're gonna cancel this event, and now we're gonna go to work with Tiffany and Kaya. Make that money. Make sure you pledge to the Patreon if you want to see us go to work with the girlies. Link is in the description. And yeah, I'll see you guys there. So y'all, we're home. Oh, Lenard, huh? But Tiffany and Mick Moss are currently arguing. Look, Mick is in for a tough time as his partner is really, really upset about that love affair of Mick's. Yeah. So Tiffany just like confronted him about flirting with Madison and he's all like, but nothing happened. But she's like, why are you lying to me? I just literally seen you flirt with this girl. And then she just complained to him about her symptoms, like about how she itching and burning. I don't know if he said something about that, but. Oh. Angry Simch from being called a Simch. What did they call me? Oh my gosh, Mick Moss, you called her a Simch? Maybe Paisley called her that, because no way Mick Moss did. <gasps> Come on, Ma, you know I got a wife? Oh my God, that's crazy. Oh, deuces, I want to be single anyway. Yeah, let's, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Oh, he about to piss her off, but Mick Moss, you ain't got nowhere to sleep. from Doba, Steve. You ain't got nowhere to sleep tonight, boo, so don't even do that. You're not assigned to no label right now. Gibbs. <laughs> hey babe, wanna have a quick woohoo session? If not, we could just relax again. Y'all, this is Trey John. This is Mariah's dad. Oh, we're gonna go. <laughs> we're gonna go. We're gonna go because Mick Moss 
Make Moss got us fucked up. Yeah. Now she about to mess with Mariah Daddy. Wait. <laughs> well, you guys. Yeah. Tiffany is hurt. And now she is currently. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Okay. Well, yeah. Now she's currently booed up with Mariah's dad, Trey John. Because Mick Moss done pissed her off so much. <laughs> this is so messy. Like, girl, what? And now I think they're about to. Oh. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh. Well. Oh. oh. Well, y'all. That is the end of our episode. Make sure you pledge to the Patreon so you can watch exclusive scenes that we can't put on YouTube. Okay? You don't want to be lost. Right? Thank you guys for watching. The Sims are doing too much. So, bye. Love you. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you want to watch some more videos, there's some right here for you to check out. I will see you guys next time with another video. Love you. Bye.